Today, we're diving deep into a topic that can often get overlooked. What should go in the caption below your reel or post on Instagram? Yes, crafting an effective caption. You know, it used to be called a description to all the OGs here. And we're talking about a description for your reel that can make all the difference that in boosting the engagement and really driving traffic to your profile. So let's make sure that you're doing it right. Welcome, if you're new here, I'm Subi Zimmerman. And I'm Morgan Sutton, and together we've taught thousands of businesswomen how to actually make money on Instagram through our digital courses and our coaching programs. Yeah, and if you feel like a total beginner because you didn't grow up with a phone in your face, you are in the right place. We want to help you have a much easier way to grow your business and leave a legacy that you are proud of using Instagram as a marketing tool. Absolutely. So if you don't follow us on Instagram at The Instagram Expert, definitely head over there because we share posts daily that give you tips on how to keep your Instagram fresh and exciting and constantly bringing in customers. Oh yeah, it's really worth following for sure. Okay, let's get down to business. You've just created an awesome reel with a killer script and an intriguing hook, and you found that trending music. But now what? Before you get to post, you have another decision to make. What should go in the description below your reel to maximize its impact? So first, if you don't know what a caption is, I want to make sure that we point that out to you. So here I am on the Instagram expert feed. You can see that there's this description below the reels that I'm able to reveal. When you're in full screen mode, so if I click in here, notice how the reel takes up my entire phone screen. Notice that there is text at the bottom that I can expand that is revealing the caption or the description, like Sue said. Uh, so this description, it's a chance to do more with your posts. It's a chance to build on a topic further or highlight one section of a post in more depth. And so we wanna make sure that you're using it and using it strategically. Yeah, and you do get 2,200 characters to write that description mm -hmm. and it can provide more insight about how using your product or service might feel or look. So give your audience a taste of what to expect or share a behind the scenes story to add a personal touch. Or don't be afraid to give a reaction or commentary in your description that goes further, right? Share a thought about what you showed in the post or the photo, ask a question, and always encourage your followers to join in on the conversation. Something that we see clients miss a lot is the opportunity for a call to action, asking someone to take a next step that's really clear and direct. This doesn't mean that it has to be extensive, right? So we'll share two examples here. It can be short and sweet, right? So here's uh, one example of a reel. Let me share over to the reel here. And this video is a Instagram hack that we shared uh, on our account. And you can see that the description, it's right here. Let me highlight it. It's short and mm. sweet, but we expanded on what the point is of the hack uh, and what they want to be aware of. Did you ever wonder how people get soft music in the background? That's what this instructs uh in the reel and also it adds that CTA. Save this reel so you have the exact instructions to use for your next batch of reels. Short and sweet, but does what a description or caption needs to do. Yeah, I think that's a great example to share. So on this reel, we use a bit of a controversial hook. Don't send people to your website and lead people to the description. Then the description goes into a longer explanation of why. When they first see the hook, they might be confused, but the description, yeah, that gives a full on philosophy that is really helpful for marketers. In this case, the caption, the, co the text below the reel is actually a really meaningful part of the post, right? So the video with the hook captures attention, but having them open and read this whole explanation is what th where the value yeah. really is, right? And an important thing for people to know is that the time it takes for someone to read this extensive description, it counts as time on your account. And so someone spending time on your account tells the Instagram algorithm that real users out there like you, which helps them share your content to more people. So it's actually really a 
one of the many beneficial ways to keep someone's attention for longer on Instagram. Yeah, and I think a lot of people don't know about that, Morgan, that the more time someone spends on your account reading is that signal to, 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 to share it, to get more reach. So I think that that's really something to consider when you're writing your description. Now, exactly. so I think Sue and I totally understand that when you first start on Instagram, there's so much work that goes into uh, putting together the right carousel or recording the right reel that when you get to the caption, you're kind of like, what exactly. else do you want from me here? <laughs> right? Like yeah. a lot of our, uh, a lot of our high end pro clients, they say the same thing. Like, what else should I be doing? And so I think that these examples show that you're able to go deeper, you're able to add emphasis, you definitely want the call to action, or you can have that uh, caption be the star of your post, right? You have a lot of options, especially because the words that you're putting below the post in that spot, that's being taken in as important keywords. That's information for Instagram to understand mm. what it is that you do and who you're looking to serve. So another reason to take advantage of that real estate. Absolutely. Now that you know the importance of having a killer description below your reel, it's time to put it all into action. And we love our action takers. And we wanted it to be as easy as possible for you to get good results on Instagram. So we actually put together a guide specifically for this purpose. It's called the Instagram Post Builder. It's a copy and paste resource that will help you create 10 days or more of posts that are strategically meant to convert strangers on the internet into engaged fans and buyers. Yes, this resource is packed This resource is packed with strategies so that you can post in a way that is fast, easy, and efficient and it doesn't suck up all your time. So don't miss out on this opportunity to supercharge your Instagram game. We have the link to the free download available to you in the description below. It has a ton of great time saving content and formatting information so that your captions are really engaging and interesting to read and good to go. Awesome. Well, thanks for tuning in. We are so excited to see what you post. Go ahead and tag us when you do at the Instagram expert. We want to see those captions help you boost your engagement on your account.